And welcome back to Ozarks Live. This weekend, the 65th annual Pro Rodeo, here to give us the inside scoop on everything that's going on is Rick Chaffin. It is great to have you here today. Well, thank you for having me. Well, we're glad that the rodeo is going to happen. I mean, lately, you don't really know what's going to happen, but so it's, so it's on. It's on. It's 65 years, and in the 65 years, we've went through lots of things in 65 years, and we've just kept on churning, and uh -huh. we decided we're going to do it again, and uh, we got a great lineup of cowboys already entered from across the United States on the way to Ozark, and uh, it's going to be fun. All right, so you've got 65, you said. Talk about what all we're going to see. There's the poster. You brought one of those in with you today. What all are we going to see there? Well, <clears throat> it's a full-scale professional rodeo. It's sanctioned by the International Professional Rodeo mm -hmm. Association. They'll be bucking horses and bulls and cowgirls, barrel racing and roping and steer wrestling. We'll have uh, Colton Almer as our entertainer and comedy act, and he'll have his famous pony Rocky with him. And, yeah. And he's going to do some tricks for the kids and the adults. Of course. Everybody likes to have fun. So. Uh, and now this is going to be at Finley River Park in Ozark, correct? Yes, it is. All right, and it's coming up this weekend. Um, so you've got, obviously, a lot going on. What, are, what kind of precautions are you taking to make sure everybody's safe this year? Is there any requirements at all? Or, I mean, it's outside, so. Yes, it's outside. We got lots of seating. Mm -hmm. We'll have hand sanitizers. Main thing we ask is use common sense, mm -hmm. be courteous to other people, and that'll take care of everything that they ask you to do. Are there any particular events going on for the little ones? Because, you know, every now and again you go to one of these rodeos and there are some little kind of some kid events that you've got going on. I was hoping you wouldn't bring that up. Oh, dear. Well, I did, <laughs> didn't I? So maybe not we this year. We always do it every year, but we've decided this year maybe 200 kids piled up in one pile in the middle of the arena wasn't the year to do it. Well, that was kind of why I asked that question, though. I mean, no, pile or no pile, you know, <laughs> you still have to do your due diligence and try yes, to keep everybody. Yes, and that's everybody... what we're doing. We we backed off of what we usually call the dash for cash. And, yeah. And uh, we thought this was a year that we just uh, maybe back away from that. Well, I think people need to know that, and I think people will appreciate that you know, in the current climate. Yeah. Again, so you've got all of these different, so there's men, there's women out there. So even if you're not one that's been to a rodeo, there's a little something for everybody to enjoy here. My, I've always said it, it don't matter if you're eight years old or 80, there's something in a rodeo you're going to go home and talk about and have fun doing it. It's clean, family, fun, and we are proud of producing that. Oh, absolutely. Well, 65 years, I mean, you're doing something right. We want to tell you there are discount tickets available at PFI. Talk about the ticket price. Totally reasonable <clears throat> for a fun night out for the family. Yeah, the ticket prices. We have a $2 discount on tickets at PFI and Apple Markets mm -hmm. in Ozark and uh, Clever and Sparta. PFI Western Wear in Springfield. If you want to come Friday night with your kids, you can go to Apple Market and they'll give you a free kids ticket. And you can't beat that deal. No, you can't beat that deal. And once again, it is coming up, let's see, this weekend, Friday night and Saturday. Starts at 8 o'clock. Okay. The gates will open at 8. We have all kinds of concessions, good rodeo food, the famous snow cones at Ozark, Missouri that I can remember from my, when I was a little kid. and. Uh, we still got them. That part of the tradition is back. Everybody yeah. loves that. All right, Rick, thank you so much. Have a great time this weekend. I'm sure it's going to be a lot of fun. All right, coming up next, we get to sit down with meteorologist Beth Finello. She's going to talk about this comet that everybody's seen but me and how you can get a glimpse of it yourself maybe tonight if it's not too hazy. Ozark Live will be back before you know it.